Hey, what's going on guys? This is Nabjot here back again with another video. In this video, we are going to install and configure file manager in the WordPress instance which was installed on Google Cloud in the previous videos. And this is the third video of Google Cloud free forever web hosting. So if you wanna host your website free forever on Google Cloud and install WordPress on it then you can watch my first video so the first thing is why we need a file manager well file manager will help to add modify and delete the files and folders in our wordpress directory and it makes quite easy to manage our wordpress files whether these files are media files or programming files to install the file manager open your google cloud dashboard and you will see this SSH button on this side. Now click on this button. So after clicking on this button, a pop-up window will open and it will take a few seconds to connect to the server. So as you can see, our server is connected. Here I am going to run few commands on this server to upload our file manager PHP file. I will provide the all commands in the description box. So our first command is sudo-s to access the root privilege. We are in the root and this navi underscore developer1 directory will different for you. Here we will need to navigate the root directory by entering the command cd space slash after that enter ls hyphen sign s command this command is used to list files and directories by default it will list the content and content information of the current directory also you can skip this command now go to this setting button and then click on upload files select the ftpp.php file to upload also you will get this file link in the description <laughs> the php file will upload on this folder now click on close again go to your home directory by entering the command cd space slash home and get the directory content by entering the command ls space siphon sign s so as you can see we have two directories inside this home directory the first one is bitnami which is common for all and the second directory will be your google cloud username and it will be different for everyone now open this directory and you will get ftpp.php file here in this directory here you have to move this file to wordpress folder by entering this command so after this command the file will be moved so let's double check it by opening the wordpress folder so as you can see our file has moved successfully so our commands part is finished and now it's time to test our file manager open a new tab in your browser window and enter your domain name <laughs> this is our wordpress domain additionally type ftpp.php with your domain name Enter the username, admin and the password and then click on the login button. Finally we are in the file manager and this is the file manager dashboard. These are the wordpress files and use these options to delete, modify and copy the files. With this option you can upload files on this server. So there are many things you can do with this file manager. I think 
it is enough for this video so if this video really helpful for you don't forget to like this video and subscribe this channel thanks for watching as always see you in the next video